right, gonna do a little modification here. Super simple, super fun. Uh, I'm gonna share it only because I'm practicing and uh, these are really, re really ridiculous, easy to do modifications. I've got one piece here. This is the uh, oil level and temp dipstick black uh, for Sportsters. Oddly, this is made in Germany and you'll see more of this in a second when I pull it out. And then we've got, uh, this probably will take one piece of equipment. Um, this is the black headlamp trim ring. So two little pieces to add to the bike, one tool to do it all. See what happens when you buy stuff from the dealership direct instead of actually going to Harley Davidson dealership is you get a box and a box. Put that over there. I don't even feel like there's anything in this. Keep it late. No, this actually doesn't have another box. It's just the ring it. Oh. Nice little black ring. You'll see why that makes sense in a second. And then, uh, yeah. Let's just hope this uh, dipstick's actually in black, too. Sometimes you get a part and it's the wrong finish. So, there it is. Figure out how this works in a second. All right, after reading the instructions, it should be pretty simple. Except I gotta get my hands a little dirty, which is fine. So, pop this one out. Get a little oil. I need to get some more. I'll just stick my finger in there. It actually says to oil the O-ring a little bit. So, get a little bit more oil. Just wipe this off with my hand. Put it on that. Push that in. And uh, yeah, when you push this button, it shows you the temperature. So right now it's 90. So yeah, press the button. Good old temperature reading. All right, this next one is so simple. Well, it's simple enough that they actually didn't even include instructions. Get a little tiny screw in here. Let's see if that light stays. All right, it's gonna come down. It's pretty heavy, you'll see that's not a stock light. It's a uh, custom dynamic, just the two hands. Remember how much of a pain this was to get in. Let's see. We have to move that out of the way. There are some clips on the back where the light sits. is actually what, what I want. So I'm just tighten it back up. And uh, yeah that's pretty uh, pretty much it. Make sure it's good and tight. Not too tight though because I think I've seen some people do this where they've tightened this so much the ring actually goes and starts the snap the glass, which you definitely don't want. 